Hey there, gamer guys and gals. Today we're talking about Nib Games and published by Red Aleka, Ken Duo. This is a little $5 indie platformer that you can play uh, alone or with friends. It has 30 stages and a uh, bonus stage when you beat the game, like a bonus level. Uh, it's pretty simple. You're basically a little square. He can push blocks and break ice. Or you're a lightning bolt that can uh, do a dash. Or it can use electricity to raise elevators. Uh, i try to show you here pretty much uh, all the basic mechanics. Uh, it's fun to play alone. You just push Y to switch between the characters. And you have to get them both to the door. Or it's fun to play with friends. Here's the little ice break stomp from the block that he can do. And then the, uh, like I said, the... The electric guy can do a little dash and he can raise the elevators. It's fairly simple. It's got really, really easy achievements. Uh, pretty much they're all you can't miss. Uh, there's one that you can miss. It's an Easter egg. And at the end of the video, I'll show you how to do that. So if you don't want to see that spoiler, then uh, don't watch to the very end. But uh, if you do want to see how to get that easy achievement, then uh, just watch. If you love Red Aleka published games and you love those easy achievement little platformers, this is definitely right up your alley. This is one of the better ones in my opinion. I had a good time with this. Uh, I never really struggled. The only level that, that I'm, I may have had an issue with was uh, level 30. It's kind of tough, but besides that, they're all fairly easy. Oh, the lightning bolt can also detonate TNT. And uh, you can... Uh, use the TNT to move these heavy blocks, the metal ones, because you can't push them. And uh, when you do that, uh, you can drop them onto the levers and it'll, uh, you know, open little gates for you. That dash is really handy, you see there, as far as, like, getting keys and stuff like that. But it, you can die, but it's not very often. Most of the time, if you die, it's your own fault. Like, uh, you drop a block on your own head. Or maybe you drop an elevator on your head when you're switching between characters. If you're playing with someone, like uh, co-op, more than likely that's not going to happen. But when you're playing solo, you know, you might uh, trigger a uh, elevator or you might knock a block over and then forgot to move the other character. But, you know, it, it's just a little fun platformer. It kind of reminds me of Adventures of Lolo. If you ever played that on the NES, it just kind of gives me that vibe but, in a, uh, you know, like a side scroller instead of a top down like uh, Lolo is. But uh, definitely, definitely uh, worth your time, definitely worth your money. It's one of those games you're going to put a good evening into. You know, you get off work, come home from school, you want to play something short and sweet, you want to add to that gamer score. This is definitely it. Uh, I don't. I think this will take you just a little over an hour, maybe, maybe not even that. Just depends how good you are at games like this. It, like I said, it's not really challenging. Uh, there's a, there's only like a few puzzles that'll even, uh, you know, make you think. Most are pretty straightforward. And uh, if you, if you're looking for something to play with a kid or, uh, you know, a girlfriend or something, this is definitely it. This is uh, a really simple title. Here you go. Here's how you can die making mistakes like this. Forget to move your guy, drop a block on his head. Pretty funny, uh, but um, definitely give it a go. Let me know what you think. If you do, I'd love to hear from you. Love to hear what you thought about it. I, I really, really enjoyed this one. I had a good time with it. I played it all last night. Uh, I played it all in just one setting. Like I said, it's a really short game. Here's the Easter egg. I'll go ahead and show you how to get it. It's on level 25. But if you don't want to see, uh, I'm okay. I'm giving this game a seven out of ten. It's a really, really good game. It's a lot of fun alone or with someone else. So uh, check it out. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. And until next time, see you on the leaderboards.